Hello guys, it's unit 3 part K. Now you need to understand few terms. Those are LMP, EDD. What is LMP? That is nothing but last menstrual period. EDD is nothing but expected delivery date or estimated date of delivery or estimated due date. LMP is the date when the women got her menses lastly. That is which was the last date when she got her period. That is LMP. And EDD is nothing but at what date the women may get her delivery pain. Based on the LMP, we will calculate at which date she may get her delivery pain. At which date she may expect the baby. Okay. To calculate this EDD, we, we have to know the LMP. Okay. Nigelis formula. Nigelis formula, there are actually two ways to calculate EDD. Those are, first we need to get to know LMP. Let's take, assume any date like 5, 3, 2022. Okay. This was the LMP for a girl. Okay. This is 5, 3, 2022. This was her last menstrual period. Now, when will be her EDD? That is expected delivery date. When will be her EDD? That is calculated by a formula that is first we need to have seven days first we need to add seven days for this day and for month we need to subtract three this is the formula this is the first formula that is first we need to add seven for the day for the day we need to add seven for month we need to subtract three this is the first formula. This is the day that is 5. We are adding 7. 5 plus 7 that is 12. Next, from 3 you need to subtract 3. Okay. In 3 if you subtract 3 that is 0. So, you can't write 0 here. Okay. So, 3 month is, 3rd month is nothing but March, February, January. Before January we have December. So, in 3 if you subtract 3. You will get December. Okay. You need to write 12 here. Not 0. If you subtract 3 from 3. You can't write 0. You have to write 12. That is March, February, January. Before January. That is back of the January. We have December. We need to write 12 here. The same month. You can't go back. You are going backwards. This doesn't mean you have to write 2021. You have to write 2022 only. If the woman is pregnant today, she will give birth after 9 months. She can't give birth before 9 months. Okay. So, you can't write 21 here. You have to write 22 only. See, if a woman is pregnant in 3rd month, she will get her baby. She will get her delivery around 12th month. Uh, there is another formula that is with the same date. Let me perform it. In this, we need to add 7 days and add 9 for the month. In this for days we need to add 7 and for month we need to add 9. Okay. 5, 7 is nothing but 12 and 3 plus 9 is nothing but 12 and the same year. So this is her expected delivery date these are the two formulas in first formula you will add 7 for the day and subtract 3 from the month in second formula you will add 7 from the day and add 9 for the month if you have any doubt do command i will give another example questions will be provided at the end of the chapter until then stay tuned meet you in the next video